the monument to Christopher Columbus, on a major traffic roundabout along Mexico City's Paseo de la Reforma, was dedicated in 1877. The statue was removed on 10 October 2020, for restoration purposes, two days before a planned protest. On 5 September 2021, it was announced that the statue would be replaced with Lali, a statue of an indigenous Olmec woman. On the monument's pedestal are two bus reliefs, one depicting showing Christopher Columbus's arrival in the New World and the other, the construction of a church. On the corners of the pedestal are statues of friars, depicted in a seated position, said to be those who were important to the early history of Mexico including Franciscan Pedro de Gante, the first to evangelize Mexico's indigenous population, and Dominican Bartolome de las Casas, and Antonio de Marchena and Diego de Deza, who aided Columbus in Spain. As with, almost all the monuments, the gift or inspiration of Europeans or Europeans of mixed descent include some reference to religion. In Mexico, where anti-clericalism and suppression of the power of the Catholic Church had embroiled Mexico in a civil war and a foreign intervention during the 19th century liberal reform, the Columbus statue's combination of religious iconography and symbolic embodiment of European conquest and domination has made the statue a target of protesters. One scholar suggests that Columbus is portrayed as a conqueror or even a conjurer, for he plucks a whale from the globe he holds. The statue was part of a plan to embellish the major thoroughfare with statues of persons of historical significance to Mexico. The work was a gift to the capital of the entrepreneur, Antonio S. Candon, a member of a wealthy, conservative Mexican family and who had supported Emperor Maximilian built the Mexico City Veracruz Railway with the help of French investments and British engineers. The railway linked the inland capital with its main east coast port. Escandon decided to commemorate the era of the railroad in Mexico with a monument to an equally epochal event, the discovery of the New World. In 1873, Escandon commissioned French sculptor Charles Cordia to design and execute the statue, which was shipped to Mexico for installation. The statue was inaugurated almost immediately after Liberal General Porfirio Diaz seized the presidency in 1876. The Cordia sculpture has been described as the construction of a monument, manipulated by a Mexican industrialist for greater economic ties with foreign investors. It was originally to be placed in front of the Buena Vista train station in Mexico City. The statue had already been commissioned and sculpted in France. Arriving in Veracruz in 1875, it was installed in 1877 under the supervision of Mexican engineer Eleuterio Mendes. On October 12, 1992, on the occasion of the 500-year anniversary of Columbus's voyage of discovery to America, a series of protests were held in different cities of Mexico. In Mexico City the monument was defaced after a protest led by indigenous groups, unions and punk collectives. The protesters tried toppling the Columbus sculpture by attaching ropes to a Ruta 100 public transport bus but the attempt was frustrated by the Mexico City Police Grenadier Corps. In later demonstrations, the monument was protected in different ways to prevent the toppling of Columbus sculpture. Based on post-colonial and anti-racist arguments in the first decade of the 21st century and after the remotion of monuments after George Floyd protests, social groups in America began the toppling of sculptures and monuments of British and Spanish conquerors or colonizers. In Mexico City, a demonstration was called on October 12, 2020, to topple the Columbus sculpture. On October 10, 2020, Government of Mexico City removed the reformer sculpture from the monument due to a previously scheduled restoration by the National Institute of Anthropology and History. The demonstration moved instead to the monument located in Buena Vista. Government of Mexico City announced that the reposition or the removal of the sculptures of the monument will be defined after a round of debates that will held on 2021. In the context of the commemorations of the fall of Mexico Tenochtitlan. Lali 
a statue of a woman from the Olmec civilization by sculptor Pedro Reyes, will be set at the site.